Hello everyone and welcome back to Grim Dawn. As the skies darken and a chill hits the air in real life, because it's cold outside. Uh, anyway, let's go over to Burr Witch and continue cleansing the world of all of this mighty evil that's just kind of around. I got quite a few quests to do in Burr Witch anyway, so, you know, may as well go and do them. May as well go and do everyone's grocery shopping, because that's what it means to be an adventurer. And naturally just beat the crap out of some spiders, because again, that's what it means to be an adventurer. It's pretty fun, actually. And I really love this hammer, it's fantastic. I think it, it isn't as fast as the uh, other axe that I had, but you know, the damage it does more than makes up for it. And it's still pretty fast. I mean, the axe is very fast, but the hammer's still fast. In terms of its uh, attack speed, I don't actually know what bracket that is in terms of how many swings per second or whatever. Or even what affects that. Stop poisoning me! That's why nobody likes you, spiders, because you... Actually, it's not really the poison so much as the fact that you're really creepy. People don't like snakes because they're poisonous. People just hate you because... Ugh, you got too many legs, you got too many eyes, you got too much of everything. You're either too small or too... Pretty much everything about you is just wrong. I mean, like, you got the skeleton on the outside of your body, you crawl, you skitter, you jump. It's actually a very long list of reasons why people just generally don't like you. I actually got a lot more ranged mobs. These It seems so weird playing a game with gob where goblins have like sniper rifles. <laughs> no! Oh my goodness, goblins are good with sniper rifles. Or rifles. They don't actually sniper rifles, just rifles. Still. Okay, what idiot decided to give goblins guns? I mean, they were bad enough when they had bows and arrows, but now they have a oh, grobble, whatever. I, I'm counting that as basically a, a goblin or a variation thereof. It's it's goblin-ish type thing, you know? So who did that? Who went and got goblins guns? That's just... Is that a big bad boss? But you see, again, it's that whole thing of, of having too many legs. Just... oh. Okay, I was expecting it to take a while to kill, but I'm gonna say the one button, it just rules the world, this one button. It just kicks ass. Smack. Seriously, this this build is, is fun. I'm really enjoying it. Boom! Dead, buddy. Why are you so dead? Home run! That's where he lands. Oh, nearly got him in the pot. That would have been fantastic if he just landed in, landed in the pot. We could have got a hole in one there. We could have won simultaneously at both baseball and golf. And Grimdor. Just been fantastic. Moldering fumes. <laughs> okay, guys, I, I don't mean to tell you how to farm. But you might want to grow something other than mushrooms, bones, and assorted weeds. I'm just saying. You may find it helpful. I mean, you're probably all dead now, so maybe you, you don't want to, you know, have some corn on the cob because you're dead. Maybe dead people don't like corn on the cob. Maybe just it, maybe it's just too irritating. You know, how how am I supposed to know? Although, you know, as long as you got some floss handy, I don't see why that should really be an issue. Am I, am I fighting... what are these? They look kind of like bat... things. They're pretty cool. I like the sonic attack, especially since it doesn't do very much damage yet. I like the not hitting me very hard part. Seeing as if they don't hit me hard, then I can stay alive longer to kill stuff. I actually need to go back to base pretty soon at this rate. S slow weapons, so it's terrible. This requires spirit. This is a dagger. Three damage per second. If I do the offhand, it's very fast. 12 to 19. It's got armor piercing. It's got just cold damage. Now, it's not really enough of a difference either way for me to actually care about trying to figure out which one's better. Besides, I think the axe is better anyway. It probably is. It's a pretty good axe. It served me well. Health potions. And money! Just collecting all the health potions money and now some food. 
adventurers must have iron stomachs. It must be like a, a prerequisite. Like, oh, you, you want to go and save the world? You better be able to, you know, have like a cast iron stomach because you're going to be eating some nasty stuff. I mean, in, in WoW, you've got the, like the crunchy spider legs. In Grim Dawn, I mean, you're eating food off the floor, so it doesn't really matter what it is. It's going to kill you. <laughs> oh my goodness, I don't want to use health potions. I don't want to. I'm being greedy. Please don't. Let me be punished for my greed. Don't punish me. Yes, regen all the health. <laughs> Wait, am I the villain? I shouldn't laugh like that. I might be the villain. For all I know, these these grubbles are, are fighting for independence. They have been ruled over by the evil humans for too long. And now, here I am, just killing their dreams, stomping all over it with some, like, one spell. One spell. Actually, a fantastic book with a single spell. Oh, it's so good. Another example of someone who does a lot of stuff with just one spell. That's the name of the book. My spell doesn't even cost mana. I think his costs, like, brimstone or whatever. It's like a, a bit of brimstone. So there you go. What am I actually... So I need... Hang on. I need to speak to Angram in the Burwich outskirts, which is the other direction. You see, I get so caught up in just blatantly murdering anything that comes across my path that I forget that I need to murder in a specific direction. There we go. Correct direction now. I hope. So we'll just murder in this direction for a little while. Works for me. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Is there something over here? Come on. Where are you, blacksmith? I need you. You got to help do stuff. You count as a mutant thing? Yes, you do. Well done. Congratulations on that. Die, eye of all demons. I don't like you in any game, because you're overpowered, generally. Ow! 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 Oh, sweet! Oh my goodness, it hurts. <laughs> what hurt? What hits that hard? Why would you do that? Oh great, now we've got frozen zombies that hit for cold damage. Come on. Why would you do that? Just... Why? I thought that we had an understanding going on. I thought that you... You know, that we understood where each of us were standing here, and... I thought that I was standing over here, picking up this hammer of the elements that I'm kind of interested to look at, because it's green. Which might mean that it's like some kind of set bonus item. I don't have any set bonus stuff, but it still might be cool. So, could you just hang on a second? I want to check stuff. Yeah, you go flying, buddy! I love it when they do that. Alright, let's have a look at this. Oh, of course, I have more inventory space. I don't even have to go back yet. I completely forgot about that, and it's right there. Anyway, let's have a look here. It's slow. And but why is it green? Are rares green? What are blue items, then? Blue items are epic. So green is rare. Yellow is... Uncommon. Blue is epic. Is legendary purple? Seeing as we're kind of moving all of the color schemes around a little bit. Just kind of rejigging it. Is there anything out here? Hello, I'm looking for a blacksmith. Do you, you want to know where you are, Mr. Blacksmith? If you could just sort of call out, set up a flare, maybe. It'd be fantastic. Boom! I, I knocked, but no one answered, so I thought I'd just come inside and, well, kill all of you. It, it's it's sort of like a weird version of a knock-knock a joke, except that I just steal all their stuff. Whoa! What's with the lightning orbs? Like, come on! You don't even know me. I could be friendly. What if I was one of your friendly neighborhood zombies? And I just came to say hello. I mean, I'm covered in enough blood to pass for a zombie, don't I? Hang on a minute. I pick up those ether crystals just in case they actually become useful at some point in time. Whoa, Mr. Zombies! Come on, I've got so little endurance left. Don't fling purple fire. No oh, green. That's not purple. In what universe, Mr. Tempest, is that purple? It's not even remotely close. If it was bright pink, it would have been closer to purple. That's green. Like not even a no. Just, you should just be ashamed. Just, just don't even talk. 
everyone's just gonna sigh and no, it's not purple. FYI, not purple. It's green. That's green. It's very much green. Pick up the damn crystal, man. We got things to do, people to kill. Again, because they're undead. I love this hammer. It seems to make them go flying even more. I wonder if that actually has anything to do with it, or if they always flew that far, or, or what happens. Oh, another ether crystal thing. Why is this a level 17 crystal? That doesn't even make any sense. There's a whole bunch of level 14s around it, but somehow the crystal is, is level 17. What's going on there? What the hell is with that? At least we did like a, a full loop around, so we didn't even have to backtrack all that much. Still gotta look for this damn blacksmith. Where are... Where is he? Maybe I should look at the quest log. Let's have a look at the quest log. It is... Securing Burwich. Secure the portal in Burwich Village. Find a roof within Burwich and secure it for the survivors. Burwich is located. I didn't even do that. Really? Okay, well, we're in the outskirts, so that's one thing at a time. Again, getting distracted. Where was I? Securing Burwich to two blacksmiths. I'm a young blacksmith refugee camp, blah 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 blah. If you recover the hangar. Nobody cares. Okay, I guess I'll just have to find him. With power of magic, and I eventually will get so lost that I will arrive at my destination. It's the way this happens sometimes. What was that? I saw movement. Oh. Come on, who's giving these damn goblin things shotguns? Who does that? Who is that stupid? Oh, this is Mud Row. Is, is this still Burwich outskirts? So we're gonna go left a bit. And this is also Mud Row. So, where the hell is the blacksmith? I think he's supposed to be somewhere in this whole giant, massive excuse for you know the Burwich outskirts. He's supposed to be somewhere here. Oh, turning his pack. Food. Where did he go? He's hiding. Probably found like a really shiny anvil. And now he's just stroking it going, My precious! That's what blacksmiths do when no one's looking. Trust me. That's what they do. Hmm. Maybe it's sort of bearish? No idea. New idea. Please tell me this is still the Burwich outskirts, and that he's just going to be here. Just be standing right here, dude. Can't the goblins be sacrificing you to some kind of random god or something? And apparently not. What are you going to do when the goblin-type things aren't sacrificing people? I mean, really. And this is the Moldering Fields. Where is this guy? Seriously, come on. If you're going to get lost, you might as well get lost in the correct general vicinity of where you should be. Cave entrance, cave entrance. I guess I'm just gonna head back down, see if I can find that sort of quest hub again. I wish there was more stuff on the map. Oh, hi. I guess I missed him before. Giant burning flaming cart. I think I'm going in the wrong direction again. I am. I am going in the wrong direction again. I do this all the time. Is this correct direction? Yes. Let's go this way. Anyway, I can't seem to zoom out. It's trying to, but yeah, I really love a smaller mini map at the moment. But I'm walking around like this large area. Okay, let's go this way. Stole the Burbage outskirts. It's down here. That should be like the bridge that needs to be repaired on the other side. Awesome. I haven't found a rift gate yet. Do they even show up? No, nothing shows up on this damn map. Hang on a minute. Yeah, it should show. So there's just nothing on this map. Hmm. It's weird. It's got all of those different things that would actually be useful, but none of them are here. Seriously? Moldering fields again? Is it back down that way? Somehow? Let's go back that way, then. See if I can find where the blacksmith is is hiding. 
and back in the borough, which outskirts again. You should show up on my mini-map. Eventually. But where is this... Wait, there's a rift gate. Burwich outskirts rift. So this could still be the outskirts. Right? So yeah, I might actually be able to find this guy after all. Oh, look, they're all down there. They are on the map. I just suck. So it's got to be over here somewhere. This is still the outskirts. Wait, I, th I thought there was a gap in the wall. The map makes it look like there's a gap in the wall. How could you? You evil map makers. Just, you just like tormenting me, don't you? You do. It's truth. I know. I have seen the truth that has been revealed to me. That's not pretty. Just like your face! Boom! Well, you know, face... what face you had, at least. Kill the casters. And now, see, now that guy with the crossbow, that's the way it's meant to be. Stop using guns, man. Stop using guns. A revolving cannon? Seriously. Who's selling... who is making money out of selling goblins guns? I mean, that's just taking arms dealing too far. Well, at least the mosquitoes don't have shotguns. There is that. Now that's when they get truly scary. Whoa! Boom! Looking for a blacksmith. So that his apprentice can make me weapons or whatever. Which means he's probably dead, because otherwise the master would be making me weapons. What? Oh, no, 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 no. You don't want to kill me. Why would you want to kill me? No one wants to do that. Ow, naturally I walk into more of you. Ow. I need life steal. Or life on hit, seeing as my attack speed is just batshit crazy. Yeah. I could go with some life steal or some life on hit. Give me some insane survivability or something. Oh, what do I do when I get frozen or rooted or stunned or something? That, I don't know. I have no idea. Come on, giant star on the mini-map. You know you want to appear. Whoa! Okay, I actually need to pay attention to other things besides the mini-map. Using all of my potions. I am so going to die when this is over. On. I actually need to go back to town fairly soon. More of the way rats. Whoa! Stop shooting at me! Come on! Why do people just... In fact, how do they just survive standing in the middle of nowhere? I found the blacksmith, or at least something quest-related. So I'm guessing it's him. It's probably like his corpse dangling off of something. No? No, it's not. Greetings, stranger. I hope you're out here fighting the good fight. I'm here for the hammer thing. What do you know about that? Duncan needs it to help the refugees. He's a talented boy, that one. The way he weaves magical properties into his craft astounds even me sometimes. I prefer a finely honed blade and a solid shield to that nonsense, though. Duncan was my finest apprentice, but he still needs to learn some priorities. Those people he's trying to help can't even help themselves. Our knowledge is a rare gift. We cannot squander it on those that refuse to fight for can. I have a group of Devil's Cross and you can join us. It's time for hammer is passed on. Doesn't matter, I'm taking it by force and mass. Blah, blah, blah. Let's pick with the first option, Devil's Crossing, eh? You certainly do seem like the capable sort. If the rest of your group is anything like you, well, humanity just might stand a chance. Very well, I will be your armorer. Together we will strike back against the invaders and retake can for humanity. Uh, why don't you... I think it's time you, you you passed it on, man. I will see that he's... Cool. Cool. Uh, the main reason I chose that is because he seemed to just... I don't know, like, if you get him, I don't know if he makes, like, magical stuff. I might be wrong. Um, in fact, he might even be the better choice for me. I, I just don't know. But I was thinking that, like, some kind of magical... You know, magic items might be nice, but maybe by magic items that means, you know, magic user items, but then what do the dexterity guys do? Anyway, let's go with, I guess, spirit, maybe? 
bonus energy, bonus duration damage, bonus magical damage, health, physique, bonus regen, pierce damage, duration damage. Okay, well, I'm going to go with some more physique. Because I can. And I think I might put some more points into some of the stuff. Or I might just finish off the jewel wield. And put one in there, maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Hmm. I think I will put Renowned Tactician. Which is about balance, strike through, and balance, we need defenses. Let's go with that one. Cool. And I'm level 15! And actually. I can kind of portal away. Let's go down to Devil's Crossing, sell some junk, and then go hand in our quest. So, yeah, this is pretty much mostly junk, I think. Junk, junk, junk. I don't actually know of any shortcut key, so I'm just doing it manually. Doing it the old-fashioned way. What's this? Ah, the quest item. Is this also a quest item? Hmm. Ancient forging hammer faster. No, it's, these are both... No, this doesn't say quest item on it, though. This makes no sense. It's so weird. 450 second duration. Oh, okay, that's some kind of potion. It's cool, I guess. Let's complete the components and stack that. Can I just sell these? I don't, I don't ever plan on using these. So I guess I'll just get a little bit of extra money. And some inventory space. Boom. Is there anyone that wants a giant beating heart? No one? No one wants a beating heart? Nobody? Going once, going twice, and nobody wants a beating heart! So I guess, you know, I'm gonna sell it if I can't find any other use for it. And let's go with Burwich Outskirts. And give the dude his hammer. So that he can have a hammer. And have a smashing good time. 